Hey, I'm Brian Goulet of the Goulet Pen Company and Ink Nouveau, and I'm a big fan of the Lamy 2000. It's one of my favorite pens. There's only one real downside to it, though, and that is that the hooded nib covers up the inscription that shows you what nib size it is. So if you're not really sure, you could be kind of left out in the cold. But there is hope for you, okay? I'm gonna show you today how you can actually check and completely verify the nib size on your Lamy 2000. So this is a Lamy 2000, if you're not super familiar with it. It's got this cool hooded nib, which does a lot of good things. Um, it keeps the nib a little bit wetter, also allows you to hold closer to the nib without getting your fingers all inky. This was from a separate incident, not from this pen. This is uninked. But there's one downfall, you can't see the nib size. Other pens, um, just show you this one for example. You know, this one shows you the nib size here, it's done, it says S for stub. And a lot of pens will have their nib size right on the nib like that. The Lamy 2000, it does, but it's covered up. I'm going to show you how to take it apart. It's pretty easy. All you got to do is grab the front, grab the middle, and unscrew. And you'll see there's these little metal prongs. That's where the cap hangs onto. The pen splits apart right there. You just unscrew it, and then you can see the back end of the feed is in there. And really, all you want to do is take and grab the nib end of the pen. You don't want to push on the tip of the nib itself because you don't want to get those tines out of alignment. But if you carefully grab near the base, then you can actually push that feed right out of there. And you see there is the nib in the feed unit that is right inside the middle there. And then if you look really close on, you can see, aha, this is a fine. So I know that I have a fine nib, Lamy 2000. Now, if you're ever curious about why doesn't Lamy sell their fine, or why doesn't Lamy sell their nibs apart from their pens on the Lamy 2000, they do it for all their other pens, they just don't for this one, it's because it's kind of a complicated setup. It doesn't actually slide off, at least not easily that I know of, uh, off of this feed, and it's gold, so it would be more expensive anyway, it's just not really conducive to selling apart from the pen, so they don't do it. So. Really, this is just to check the nib size, or if you want to clean it more thoroughly, you can do it. Then to get it back in there, you got to look at it straight on like that. There's one flat side, and then there's one curved side. And it is made to accommodate the nib shape. So all you want to do is look in it this way, and make sure that you have the flat side down, and make sure you have the nib facing up like that, so it kind of matches. You just gently kind of feed it through there, You'll see the nib kind of poking out, and then you just push on it gently until it stops. You don't need to really shove it. It'll just kind of naturally stop. And then you want to make sure that you have this little ring. This ring here just pops right off. That is the ring that is made to hold the cap in place. So if you lose that, you're going to be in trouble, or you won't be able to cap your pen at least. And then you just take, screw it together like so, and voila, you've now checked your nib. Now I will say it's a little tough to get out at first. Once you remove it the first time, it gets a little easier. But if you have to kind of monkey with it and really push on it at first, don't be completely surprised. But at least now you know how to check the nib size on your Lamy 2000. If you've got any questions about the Lamy 2000 or anything else for that matter, you can just leave a comment here on YouTube or Ink Nouveau, or you can hit me up on Twitter or Facebook. Thanks so very much for watching and right on.